what's up guys welcome back to my channel so i'm not even gonna waste your time today girl listen get into this hair get into it so i'm collaborating with my faves sam beauty again to bring you this amazingly voluminous curlicious unit from sensational so this is the rule breaker from the sensational's newest line the curl kinks and co um they have three different wigs three different textures and the rule breaker i believe is the kinkiest texture i have to double check that if i'm wrong i'll leave it down below but i am getting my life with this wig like this wig is just everything and you gotta say that slow everything it's got all bases covered the hair texture is perfection the hair texture is like a yakky texture the shine on the wig is just right it has a natural sheen to it it's not extremely shiny like those old synthetic wigs like you used to get um, even the texture of the curl even the curl pattern looks like an actual you know actual curl it's not like some manufactured jerry curl foolishness magic glow soul glow hot mess like sensational got it right on all bases and <laughs> i love it so let me give you the specs of this wig so this wig has two combs in the front one comb in the back plus the adjustable bands it features a three-way part so it's comes when you get it it's comes parted down in the middle but you can flip the wig to side to side and i'll have a video um probably right about now showing you how i flip the wig and how i got to my curls to be the way that they are because they don't look like this when it comes straight out of the box when it comes straight out of the box it looks like how you would expect curly wigs to look it looks uniform it looks like jerry curl it looks like it's about to be something that your grandmama wore and she likes to wear to church or something like that so you have to do a little bit of manipulation not too much to get it to like this so what i do for my curls um i just go in and just run my fingers down the shaft i don't really like run my fingers through the hair because i don't want to break up the curl too early so i just start running my fingers along the hair shaft um just getting it nice and voluminous and if i feel like i want more separation um then i'll go in with my fingers and kind of just rake through the curls um you want to do like with all curly wigs you want to really like do it in levels because if you go too hard too early your hair will be a hot mess and you can't you can't reverse that so that's what i do i just run my fingers through the wig and then i'll go back in and then finger comb it and that's what i did with this wig and i just do this every once in a while now it's not it doesn't look exactly like it does in the picture but they never really do i wish they had true representation though of what the wig looks like in person but it's okay like it's still i still love it and i didn't have to do like besides fluffing it out i didn't have to do too much manipulation to it all i did after fluffing it out all i did was just really cut a few curls just to kind of carve out my face a little bit so the hair doesn't overwhelm my face because hair at this length really makes my face look a little bit wider a little bit chubbier than it already is so i just need to you know create a little bit of face framing to open up my open up the hair and bring my face out a little bit and i'm very happy with the way that it looks so like i said earlier you do get parting space and you get an adequate amount of parting space you get at least like three and a half to four inches of parting space me personally i think the parting space looks a little bit artificial um it's not bad at all and you can definitely tweeze it if you want to i don't really do any of that especially for a synthetic wig i don't really waste my time trying to do the parts but i prefer to wear it like this anyway the way that the hair falls at least on my wig i did see other people with this wig and like their middle parts came out like perfect mine kind of like the hair wanted to come forward it wanted to be forward so that's listen hun 
that's what I did. You literally have four ways that you can wear this wig. Middle part, off to the sides, or bring a bang out and just live your life. And that's what I'm doing. And I am here for it. I've gotten so many compliments on this wig the past week that I've been wearing it. I do plan on getting this wig in every single color and style. So you will really see this whole line on this channel soon. I love it. I really don't have too much to say about this wig. The one con that I really have about this wig, and it's not, I can't even really call it a con. Um, I find that on me, the cap is a little bit too small. Um, it's not uncomfortably small by any means. I don't know if the way the cap was constructed, it was done like that so you could have leave out, but there's a significant amount of gap between my hairline and the actual wig. And since, you know, my hair, I wear a tapered fro now, so I don't really have a lot of hair to pull out on the sides. It's not really too big of an issue when the wind blows because my hair is just long enough on the sides to kind of blend it in. But um, I don't know if that was a design feature or if the cap is just a little bit too small. I don't, I don't know. I didn't really see anybody else have an issue with it, but for me, I, I don't know how I feel about it. But other than that, other than that small, insignificant, tiny issue, this wig, oh, it's perfection. I love it. I'm getting my life. This is one of the first times I've been truly excited, like super, super, super obsessed and excited about a wig. Besides my Altre Kinky Curly um, that I've just been obsessed with straight out of the box, and this is it. I don't have too much to say about it because it's hot. I got my air conditioner on and I've got oily skin. I'm about to be a, about to be a grease ball. So let me hurry up. Let me show you this wig real quick. Y'all, let's get into it. Mm -hmm. Y'all, let's get into it. Isn't this perfection? Love it. So thank you to Sam's Beauty for collaborating with me again. You will see them more in the future on the channel. So make sure you go down to samsbeauty.com and check out this wig. You need it. This is the perfect summertime wig. This is you lounging on the beach, fanning yourself with a nice margarita, or you have a young gentleman fanning you down with a palm leaf or something like that. Get your life, girl. Get your life with this wig. Check it out. So thank you guys for watching. If you did get this wig, let me know down below in the comment sections. You can let me know on Facebook, Instagram, and Snapchat. Your girl is actually using Snapchat quite regularly now, you know, getting back into the social media game. So come follow me on all of them. Let's chop it up. And in the meantime, I will talk to you guys later.